Hey everybody, Ray here with TJ's Reviews, and today we have another Costco uh, food for you. Um, it's a breakfast burrito by Red's Meat Lovers Edition. So it's a, a frozen um, burrito that is quick to heat up and what I think is pretty tasty. So let me flip you over to the nutritional facts and we'll talk about what's, uh, what's inside. So here are the ingredients. Um, they're a long list, but actually there's nothing really unnatural about it. There's no real preservatives um, that I really see, and everything seems pretty uh, on the up and up. So um, I'm very surprised. And uh, for allergens, it has milk, wheat, and eggs. So um, that's uh, something to consider, but the listing is actually pretty good. Let's uh, take a peek at the nutritional facts. Okay, so here are the nutritional facts. It's not very healthy or keto friendly, but um, it is great in a pinch. 350 calories, 32 carbs. So it's a lot of calories, a lot of carbs, a lot of fats, 30% in your saturated fats, a lot of cholesterol. It's not healthy. The ingredients are um, pretty natural sounding, but the product is not healthy. There's uh, two different ways to cook it, conventional, conventional oven and microwave oven. I'm using the microwave oven uh, because I want to cook it quickly. So I'm going to heat it up and uh, bring you over to what it looks like. Okay, here are the burritos microwaved and there's a little bit of a disaster. Um, the fillings uh, kind of exploded out the side. Um, it kind of lost structural integrity, but they're soft and cooked. So let me bring you over to FaceTime and give it a bite and uh, let you know my thoughts. Ooh, it's pretty hot. Okay, so it's hot, uh, but um, it tastes good. The, the tortilla is not dried out from the microwave. Um, inside it, the sausage, there's sausage and bacon, which I could taste a little bit of both. A uh, good amount of sausage, a little bit of the bacon. Um, the uh, inside, it tastes very cheesy. It's very um, juicy. I don't think that's the right word for it, but um, it's, it's not dry on the inside. It's actually very flavorful and um, very uh, full of moisture, like uh, just, I don't know how to describe it. It's just, if, uh, it's kind of like the Burger King breakfast burrito. If you ever tried that, it's kind of like that same experience, actually. It's it's very nice and salty, a good flavor bomb. Um, inside is not dry at all. So if you ever had the Burger King breakfast burrito, it's actually very similar to that. Um, I like it quite a bit. Um, I would buy this again for a breakfast burrito, for the simplicity. I would rate it a... 8 out of 10, it'd probably be a 9 out of 10 if it didn't explode in the microwave, just following the directions. Um, maybe they need to adjust the power or something, but I didn't think my microwave was too powerful. Um, but the taste is good, the convenience can't be beat. From a health standpoint, it's not that great, so that kind of supports the 8 out of 10, where you don't want to be housing these all day. These two burritos actually 700 calories, so... That'd probably be a lot for me. Um, I'm probably gonna go over my calories on, on my um, dinner, but I'm gonna throw some hot sauce on it and enjoy. Here's a look at what's inside the burrito. You can see the bacon, the sausage, the cheese. It's um, very ooey gooey and yummy. Um, can't forget the Cholula hot sauce. So, that, oop, <laughs> that looks like a perfect little breakfast bite there. So, it's good eats. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Ray from TJ's Review signing off. Mm.